Hi, what a surprise to see you here. What, what am I doing? I'm making a fairy house. Come on over and take a look. What a fairy house is? It's a magical place that you create in your yard for the fairies to come or little animals to come and visit and have a playground and a house. So what I did today was I went on a nature walk through my yard and I picked up interesting nature items that I thought would be good for my fairy house. So here are a few of the magical treasures I found. Let me show you a feather, probably from a woodpecker somebody's pistachio shells that I think are going to make great little plates for my fairies. A very interesting plant growing out of a chunk of dirt. Not sure what to do with this yet. Some lichen on a stick. A really pretty nutshell. And look at this guy. A little green fly. Okay, let me show you some things in my fairy house. First, my house has a little table that I made by putting a flat rock on another rock. And then those pretty nuts I found, I decided they'd be good chairs for the fairies at the table. Now I'm going to add a feather, my feather back here to decorate my house. And what about you think Mr. Cranefly could come visit and sit at the table? Uh-oh. What else? Oh, my dishes. Let me get my little dishes. One, two, three. So I still have three treasures I haven't used. I have my interesting grass, my lichen, and another nut. So if you have any ideas of what to do with these in my fairy house, you can send a message to Miss Elaine and make suggestions. Now let me tell you some rules about making fairy houses. You should only use natural items if possible. Now I used vines on my roof here but if that's too hard you can use string or you can break the rules a little bit sometimes but like my petals i found these on the ground with this oh i don't see it. my flower a camellia that was on the ground but i picked these azaleas out of my yard you should not pick any flowers unless you make sure it's okay with whoever they belong to so i'm going to keep working on this fairy house and you can make one at home too. And send in pictures to Miss Johnson and show us what you've done. Check back soon and see what else I've added to my fairy house.